So what is acid base uh, uh, classify uh, whether KClO3 is acid or base? KClO3 is acid or base. So when we talk about acid or bases, like we said before, acids again donate an electron, right? They donate an electron. So for example, uh, let me do it in blue. An acid would be something like HCl, right? HCl donates the electron, right? So if I put it in solution, H2O, what it's going to do is going to donate. This hydrogen is going to leave HCl. And I'm going to get H3, H3O plus plus Cl minus, right? And H3O plus here uh, is the hydronium ion. That determines the, the, the acidity of our solution here. So pH means, I, which means it is a hydrogen donor. And our pH is less than seven, right? Sorry, pH is less than seven here. So that's an acid. What are the base? A base is the exact opposite. Right? If I have a base here, base here, I'm gonna have, for example, base, uh, I use NaOH as my example, plus H2O. It's going to dissociate and form, so it's I've a, uh, OH minus, and then I'm gonna have here OH minus plus, I have also, um, uh, and the Na and the Na plus here. So this here, I have uh, two, uh, two. Um, I have kind of two, uh, two. Wait, hold on. I can balance. I can, let me balance. Let me balance this for you, as well. Um, oh, H. I have O and O. I have two O's on this side, and I have three H's. Um, I think it, I think I've added an H two O here. Sorry, this here is also. Sure. Uh, yeah. So that's sorry. That's solution. But this oh, this hydroxide ion here um, again has the um, uh, determines the the pH, right? And again, the hydroxide ion is uh, has a pH is greater than seven, right? So I can say that uh, this is a hydrogen acceptor, right? Hydrogen uh, acceptor. I can say the pH is greater than seven. And then obviously neutral solution would be pH at equals seven, right? So let's look at KClO3. So knowing these definitions, let's look, let's look at KClO3. So KCl3 is made up of two things, right? Like if I if I dissociate this or uh, into solution, I get again, I get the cation and the anion, right? I get K plus here, plus I get ClO3 minus here. And ClO3 is chlorate, right? So I have K plus and chlorate, right? And again, what I can do is I can do the exact same thing as my, um, as my, uh, uh, as my uh, previous question when I talked about acid base neutralization, right? So let's look at that. So remember acid base neutralization, I need here, uh, let me do this in blue. I need acid base, right? Acid plus base give, would give me a salt and water, right? In this case, I already have my have my salt here, right? I have KClO3. And the reason why I know I have my salt is I have a cation and an anion, right? So I know that it's here is my salt plus water, which is H2O. And again, I so what what would my base be in this case? My base is made up of my metal and a hydroxide, right? So again, here there would be KOH would be my base. So this here is a strong base, and then obviously uh, I have a ClO3. Minus here, so I need uh, an acid, right? Which means I need uh, this would be HClO3, right? So I have here this is a uh, uh, chloric acid, chloric acid plus KOH, uh, potassium hydroxide would give me KClO3 plus water, right? So in this case, I have chloric acid, uh, chloric acid. Let me just uh, uh, let me just f uh, uh, find the Ka for you. Chloric acid is has a Ka of chloric acid is a strong acid. Chloric acid has a pK uh, Ka of one, right? So in this case, it dissociates fully in solution, which means I have a strong acid and a strong base. So this here is a strong acid. Sorry, strong acid. This is a strong base because I have a hydroxide. That's a dead giveaway for being a strong base, which means this here is my neutral solution. So in this case, uh, it's not actually, uh, potassium chlorate is actually a neutral solution. It's not acidic or basic. So let's look at, uh, so therefore, let me write this down. KCl3 is neutral. This here is my correct answer. Sorry, 
Uh, so I have here as his acid is defined as substances that release hydrogen ions in water. Sweet. Okay, that's fine. Acid acids dissolve in water to form solutions that conduct electricity and have a pH smaller than seven. Good. Uh, base is any metal oxide or hydroxide it has a ph of more than seven potassium chlorate is an ionic compound that is dissociated into these two that's good neither of these ion ions is hydrolyzed in water so the ph would be seven so potassium chlorate is neither an acid or base it is in salt formed in the reaction hclo3 and the base koh that's what exactly i wrote here which means uh solution here uh solution is correct but i wish they included that kclo Three is a neutral, is a neutral salt, rather than just saying it is an ionic salt. They say ionic salt, yeah, ionic salt. So it's a neutral salt. Because sometimes, sometimes you can have acidic salts and basic salts, like we looked at in the previous question, right? But I'm gonna say solution is correct. But I wish they included this part here. Solution here is correct. I say the solution. Sure, solution here is correct.